This content is for educational purposes only. What you do with this information is at your own risk. Thank you for watching. Enjoy. How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to another video. So I want to address an issue that's happening currently with the latest CFW working on the latest switch firmware, which is right now 21.0.0 at the time of this video. And I'm using the latest CFW Atmosphere 1.10.0, the pre-release. Now, I'm not sure if this is an atmosphere issue or something else. Maybe it will get fixed, but for now, it hasn't gotten fixed. And I wanted to show you how we can fix it. But let me first show you what I'm talking about. So those of you that are using uh, just an updated pack, you might experience this issue, maybe. And that is when you enter any one of your titles, you'll have this forever loop of please wait. And it just doesn't stop until you push the home button, stop it. So this happens when you're on Wi-Fi. And if you're able to go into airplane mode, and that's when you're holding it directly on the switch. I can't do that because I'm in duck mode. But if you're able to enter airplane mode, then you're able to enter any one of your titles. But right now, I can't do anything about this without being able to go into airplane mode. So I did look online and I found some uh, resources that work around this issue in which I'm gonna be showing you today. But before I do that, I just want to let y'all know that those of you that are using my custom, uh, the other side, uh, AMS packs, I already have fixed this issue. This is for those of you that are still experiencing this issue and haven't, uh, fixed it yet or are not using my packs, which you should be because I take care of this community as best as I can. But if you're still experiencing, nonetheless, I can uh, show you exactly what you need to do in order to bypass this. All right, so let's get uh, started. Okay, so there are two possible ways to bypass that forever looping message that you might have on CFW. And I'm only going to focus on one because I don't want to do the other but I will say what the other one is. So right now, the other one is using an app called Link Aldo or Link Aho. I don't remember what it is. I've never used it before, but this app allows you to unlink and link switch accounts. And it looks like according to research, people use this app to unlink their account and everything is working just fine on Wi-Fi with their uh, CFW on the switch. So this other route that I'm gonna be showing on this video does not unlink your account and it also works with the bypass so let's go ahead and get started with that okay so the first thing that we can do is open up the sd card and it doesn't matter how you open up your sd card as long as you're able to transfer your files and edit them successfully i am using the hecate sd card tools i recommend it i never have any issues and also you don't have to take out the sd card and put it in your pc you can uh, access the sd card through usb with switch to pc so with the sd card open we're gonna to have to edit this file called system settings. So if you go into the atmosphere folder of your S, uh, of your CFW setup, and you can go into the config, you might have a system settings here, or you might have nothing at all. So what you would need to do is you can go into the config templates, and then you can get it from here. So you can have the system settings. If you don't have it yet, you can copy it and go into config and then paste it in there. So there we go. Now that you have the system settings.ini in the config folder, we can now enter this folder. And here you'll see a lot of lines that uh, control the system settings, or you can control with system settings. But all you need to do is go down all the way to the bottom, press enter, and then you're gonna wanna enter these text lines to uh, activate that bypass. So here I have my set up from my packs. So another shout out to my packs. If you want to use my packs, you don't have to do this. But if you're not using my packs, you can uh, locate or look at this file right here. And you're going to want to add this to your system settings.ini. So I know I'm just copy and pasting, but I'm going to make this real big or I can probably put it on the screen somewhere. Uh, of what it is that way you can type it out, but it has to look exactly like this And you don't have to put these uh, colons just type it out like this and we should be good to go So now you, all you need to do is just go ahead and save And that's it now you can eject out of your SD card and try it out So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and show you 
and I'll see y'all back on the switch. Okay, so now we're back on the switch. I have my Wi-Fi connected and I should be able to enter my things now on Wi-Fi. So that's pretty much it. Uh, other things are working. There you go, entered the deck. And just to show y'all that I am still on the latest Switch firmware with the latest Switch uh, CFW. So we're still, I have stick drift. <laughs> there you go. Current version 21.00, AMS 1.10.0. Oh, that's how you bypass that. But of course, if you don't want to do what all this uh, editing, you could just update with my CFW packs and it's already there for you. But on that, thanks for watching and I hope this helps. See ya.